I really do like it. I do. I just gotta get a little used to it a little bit more. Oh! Whoa, what the? Oh, no! Oh, man! She... They took out my, uh... My bottom, uh, step! Holy crap! Welcome back, Survivors. This is DW118 with ButtonMashingGamers.com, bringing you another episode of Seven Days to Die on Insane Difficulty. This is my Undead Rising uh, titled playthrough. This is day seven. Night, uh, night Horde is coming. Uh, we got a few minutes to uh, waste here while I kind of just show you my defensive works here. I've got a barbed wire up top here. Um, you can barely see it. I didn't quite finish it. Uh, it's down below here because originally I wanted it lower. Um, I was going to put some wood spikes. I'm just kind of testing this out. I don't know if I like it or not. I accidentally set this one upright. Um, I don't know, really. At that level when it's flush at the ground, I don't think it matters all that much. But anyway, and then I've got two rows of these wood spikes. Of course, here only one row because I have one of each. Uh, set up and then barbed wire of course all the way around um, I've got two entrances these are just court of course makeshift ones until I can build the base up a little bit better uh, but yeah and then of course my garden is getting bigger and bigger I've got rows and rows of uh, food here eventually uh, issue with meat is still an issue um, I did uh, listen to one of my subs JC and I lowered the invisible uh, variable down. Um, most of the variables though were already set uh, to three. Um, otherwise, there was only a few that were at six. So I I don't know. Um, of course, one of them was the forest biome and the desert biome. Those were already those were still at six. So I lowered those. So we should see a little bit of a uh, significant change. Where well, I would think some kind of a change. Um, I don't know. Um, because in the winter by in the snow biomes I didn't really notice anything different there and those were set already at three so I however I did that's where I did find the deer was in the uh, snow biome uh, that was the most uh, they were most common there anyway we're gonna get ready to set this off here I think I'm somewhat prepared if for some reason this place falls apart I got a base over there um, I do have my underground section here so Hopefully it doesn't get all beat up. Um, all right, here we go. All right. Now I'm hoping that that um, that barbed wire is going to keep them back a little bit. I have a feeling those spiked clubs are going to do the most damage. I mean, they're, they're pretty robust. I've uh, seen right there when that guy's jumping around. Um, those spiked clubs. I think they're the way to go. Um, Cause man, look at them. They just, it just tears them up. Um, whereas the, the, the log spikes, I don't know. They don't seem to do damage um, as well. Okay, so now here I'm running into trouble. I'm not keeping up with, uh, with the horde here. Um, the only problem I bet with those uh, barbed wires is I'm going to lose a lot of loot um, just simply for the fact that it's going to disintegrate these four blocks. But you know what? Hey, that's the price I pay for staying alive, I suppose. Huh? So we'll just continue to work these guys over here. Um, this might be the weak point of my base just because most of them are, are coming in this direction. So um, that is going to be a problem eventually on, on bigger horde nights um, where they're you know but by the, hopefully by that point I've got a decent enough base that will uh, I'll be able to withstand the punishment um, but we'll see kind of turned up the sensitivity on my mouse so if it's a little jerky that's why um, I like the responsiveness of it when it's turned up a little bit like that. It makes it a little more jittery, but um, I, I don't know. I like the speed of it. Especially when I'm going through my menu or my inventory. It's, it's really helpful to have it um, to have it sped up. Out here, it's not quite as beneficial. It is somewhat. But 
Not as much. I'm not sure if that zooming is gonna help me at all. I do like to be able to kind of be out in the distance here. It seems like they're way down there. Um, I'm only five blocks up, I thought, from the ground, and they're a little elevated because, um, you know, the spikes kind of push them up a little bit. But, uh, yeah, so this might not be all as, as exciting as it usually is where, you know, I, I fall down, get beat up, um, but we got to quit doing that. we got to start staying alive a little bit longer here. Um, if I want to make any progress, anyway, otherwise... Sure, if I just want to keep dying, I'm staying at a below 100 wellness. Uh, yeah, I could just go back to my old ways, but we gotta adapt, try new things here. Yeah, see, they're starting to break through right there. Um, but that's all right. We can do that. And what's nice is it does help kind of uh, replenish. Um, Especially, it helps me to put up new spikes and stuff like that. Um, you know, especially if I don't want to stay with the wood lock. Just the wood spikes. Yeah, I probably want to come to a different section, huh? Otherwise, they're just gonna... We're gonna break through at some point. Alright, well, they, they, I think they get impatient. They just go different directions anyway. I'm not sure I need to do a whole lot. I do want to get rid of these guys here. Because they've been there a while. And they're just going to be digging underneath me. There we go. I got one of them. Eventually, I will put some iron bars out so I can go out a little farther. This is kind of dangerous when you're trying to stay on the edge here and shoot them. Oh, what? There we go. That was nice. Yeah, when you're just trying to creep along the edge here, it makes it very dangerous. There we go. I wonder when, she, when I was going to knock her back. And when they jump, it makes it a huge pain in the butt. There we go. There we go. Wow, she got quick. I got these two Yahoo. Oh, come on. I just gotta learn to be a little more patient. There we go. I don't know who I hit on that one. I thought it was him. Uh oh. I hear metal breaking. Oh, that must be the barbed wire. Yeah. I'm starting to break through here a little bit. Maybe kind of. I'm gonna drag him this way a little, maybe. Um, yeah, I don't know if I like digging those log spikes down below me really like that because when it leaves a huge gap there, um, when they do break, you know, break the uh, log spikes. Although eventually I could upgrade it where they're gonna last a lot longer than that. But, you know, in the same regards, there's gonna be more. Zombies coming through too, so. so it might just be relative. There we go. So this girl's just stuck. Alright, we got Big Mama coming in. Yeah, so they're going through that dugout area there. This guy's still alive. We need to finish him. Oh, come on. Just gotta wait for it. Wait for it. Or just hit him. Maybe hitting him would be nice. Nice change from the norm. Yeah, I think that other zombie's in the way. I don't think I'm gonna get hit until I take either Big Mama out or him. There we go. Just keep getting her back. There we go. Yeah, 
Eventually, she's got to go down. Man, I've hit her a ton. Oh, she is down. Oh, that's odd. Unless I hit somebody else. Um. There we go. And so far, not too bad. They haven't really done a whole lot of damage, I don't think, to my, my base. Um, of course, I can't see the extent of it from up here, but... Um, I need to work on her. Oh. Big Mama's still awake over here. Alright, good girl. You came up here. Did she die? Yeah, she must have. We got one left. One lucky winner alive here. Come on, come on. Oh, really? There we go. Get another one. Yeah, there we go. See, look at all that. What a waste. There are no gore blocks in that little area there. Although, this did hold up a lot better than I thought it would. Um, eventually, when I get electricity going, too, I can get more spotlights down there so I can see what's going on. Um, not to mention see out just a little bit further, kind of extend my perimeter. Um, I still haven't figured out how far I want my wall to come away from the, the building. Um, eventually when I do get a mini bike, I want to be able to park it inside the base, which is going to require me to put some kind of ramp to uh, allow me to jump in and out of my base. Um, but, uh that's going to be an option anyway. I might try and do that. Um, so that's going to require the base to be bigger. Um, unless I put it along the sides um, where I jump uh, along the side of the wall or uh, maybe even onto the wall. Maybe I have a ramp. You know how I have the kind of my ramp in the middle. I put it more offset on the edge here so when I jump, I jump onto a wall. Uh, that's always a possibility. I don't know. There's a lot of things to think about. I'm not like a huge designer builder uh, in Seven Days to Die, but um, I do like making a base. I just don't have, uh, as far as fresh new ideas, that I don't have. I don't know where that guy is. Maybe if I jump out here, let's get real crazy, huh? I think he's over here. I think it's a crawler or something. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Did he get stuck over here? Oh, yeah, here he is. Okay. It's a crawler, and he just got hung up, I think, on... On the base over here. There we go. Uh, so, ooh. whoops! Sorry, folks. Still getting used to the my mouse here after I jacked up the settings. I I really do like it. I do. I just got to get a little used to it a little bit more. Oh! Whoa! What the? Oh no! Oh man, she, they took out my, uh, my bottom, uh, step. Holy crap. Oh, that was scary. That was truly scary. Let's, uh, yeah, let's not use the med kits. We're safe for the most part. Kind of, not really. Wow, that is crazy. There you go. Take an arrow to the face. Oh, you liked it. Um, wow. Yeah, that was that was scary. So I could put some. Well, I got to take out some of those ore blocks, otherwise I can't. Oh crap! Oh crap! 
This is where the mouse is really hurting me here because I gotta make small adjustments here. Oh, dang it. There you go. He's sinking into that barbed wire. There you go, buddy. So maybe getting out there right now is probably not the the brightest idea. What? I'm, I was hitting that one lot. What the? Come on. There we go. Okay, so you know what? We're gonna have to wait. This makes for kind of a long night. Um. Maybe one more bandage here. In case I get hit. Yeah, they're still coming. They're still coming. And I need to repair my bow as well. Oh, I think that was my base that just broke apart there. That's not good. Alright, so we need to repair the bow. What does the bow require? Oh, I can't remember. His oh, wood. We can do it. We can do it. Alright. Back in business. Wow. I used a ton of arrows. Let's do this. Oh, uh, we got crawlers already? What? Oh man, how is the barbed wire not getting him? Oh, that's why. Dang it. And I suppose I can't put these down either, can I? Oh boy. Stay right there, buddy. Oh, of course. If I can just keep hitting him, I can probably stun him long enough that he'll quit moving. Wow, when did, when did crawlers start coming right away? On the first week? That's not cool. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'm still at odds about the log spikes. I don't know. I'm going to have to think about that. These spikes, man, they are ferocious. Look at that. They're dead. Pow. Just like that. Didn't even stand a chance. Would like to get them down here, but or even out on the perimeter here. Maybe I should do that. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. But... Whoa! Stop moving! Stop moving! him in the head. Get a headshot. Headshot. There you go. That barbed wire is keeping him there, though. That's good. If I can just time it just right, he won't get a shot at the uh, barbed wire. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, now if I could just... Dang it. Yeah, this is not good. And of course, they don't show up till after I get off the base, and they and they start showing up. Yeah, they're they're out there. They're out there. Oh, that's that's not cool. Yep, that's my usual antics where I, uh, I fall down, try and kill myself. Oh, come on, I can't put that in there? You gotta be kidding me. Can I at least repair that? Okay, good. Alright, so that's already repaired. There we go, we can just, yeah, there we go. Here the barbed wire, whatever we need here. Alright. Isn't so bad. Alright, maybe I'm gonna start moving some of these door blocks here. Whoa. 
I know this is asking for trouble. I heard that. I want to put this block back here. Oh boy. Did I destroy that? Here comes wave number two. Dang it, I think I did destroy that. Dang it. They're coming. Alright, only, what, less than two hours till daylight. Oh, it's a crawler. Here I am, scared of a crawler. There we go. Oh, really? Come on. Oh, man, I really gotta get that up a little higher. That's just, that's too dangerous. I'm trying to make it back across like that. That's just asking for trouble. Did that kill him? Oh, okay. Didn't think that did, but you know what? I'll take it. There's another one. This could be it. Oh, see, that's the stupidity that oh, I'm talking about. That's terrible. <laughs> and I was up to, what, 77 health? Oh, oh that's just wrong. Yeah, you know, it's it's terrible when you find a way to, to kill yourself. It's a downright shame. Is what it is, really. Whoa! What the? Wow, that guy caused a lot of damage, and I'm not even sure what he did. Well. Back to killing. Oh, and he's just tearing my base apart, too. Oh, come on, come on, come on. I just gotta keep letting him have it here. Oh, that was... There we go, come on. There we go, we just keep pushing him back here. Finally! Alright, let's get him in the nuts. What? Did he miss? He's got no balls, that's why. Oh, come on, really? Come on, take his legs out for me. There we go. He sounds like he's gonna explode. Alright, so let's see, can we clear the... No, nope, that's probably a bad idea. Yeah, we've, we're, I'm gonna have to... Well, I could just replace that uh, outer lower level with, um, with uh, flagstone and then just upgrade it from there. Or just put up another layer around this, make it even thicker and then put flagstone, which might be the easiest to do. Um, just would require me to, uh, break all the wood spikes, which, yeah, does not sound like a great option. It sounds like a waste, but, uh, there we go. Oh, come on, lady. Come on. Oh, did I miss? Really? Guess that's not so hard to believe, but, uh, man, she's like right there in front of me. Alright, come on, folks. We gotta be done here soon, aren't we? 
And then we can start the looting and the cleanup process. Fun. Fun, fun. Remember, I really don't want to go down below, but yeah, this will give me a chance to show you. Oh, somebody there. down below I'll show you the base here while we're waiting so of course this is where I've dug before I think I showed you that we went around started digging out a little more area got my workbench down here um, what did I need some metal I think that's what I needed um, well, let's start working on some flagstone huh and I, you know what I don't even need to build it here let's yeah let's do this Good enough. All right. Ooh. Yeah, let's see if there's any unwanted guests out here. Man, I can't believe I died. That just... Oh, that sucks. Because what a waste of all that bacon and eggs that I made. That meat, the eggs. Just down the tube when you die like that. Oh. Uh, and of course, these don't give you any uh, wellness. Um, but I do have some goldenrod tea. I'm starting to drink that now. I should make a chrysanthemum, a red tea, but I think that just cools you off mostly. Um, I know this gives you. Um, well, we could try it. Let's just try it while we're waiting. Um, I know I should know this stuff, but. Yeah, let's just do a piece of wood. Excuse me. I don't think it, in terms of wellness, I'm not sure it's going to offer more, but you can check it here. Of nails. Okay. It's almost daytime, folks. Almost daytime. Another crawler. I suppose we're going to get uh, a few crawlers along the way here just because they're going to finally catch up with the, uh, or would have caught up with the, the horde. What's he doing? Is he dead? I have no clue. Alright, so let's check this out. Whoa, what was that? Oh, another guess. Last minute party crasher. All right, it is officially day now. Um, so I'm assuming the day, the horde stops at this point. I guess there's no guarantees. Anyway, so cool. Yeah, it cools you off. Uh, so really, I'm not sure if it's all that different. No, not really. Other than that removes dysentery and this. Oh, that does too as well. Uh, but this. Cools you off, I suppose. I don't know. Eh. Why can't I drink? Oh, I'm full. Derp, derp. All right, let's go do some cleanup here. Let's see what kind of goods. Oh, he destroyed all my. We never have enough of those. So let's take a look at what we got here. Anything good? No. It. I want to know what this guy has. Oh, that was a big guy. He didn't have nothing. Oops. Yeah, they did a number on that base down there. I think that was the bat worst idea was to have. Look, oh, what am I? Is there barbed wire? Oh, it must be. Yeah, that was kind of the. I think that was the worst idea was to put those 
have to sink down those uh, um, wood log spikes. I think that was. Oh, come on. Oh, I'd already made some. I just didn't put them in, in my tool belt. Alright. Make sure I don't want to repair anything. Derp, derp. Okay. So, you know, this is where I, I need to think about do I want to put those blocks there? I think that's the best option. Otherwise, I'm going to waste all that barbed wire, all that metal. Um, yeah. Oh, don't do that. Dang it. Ah, uh, well. What do you do? Keep pushing the wrong button. Dang it. <laughs> So we got all that. I'm assuming I'm not going to get a whole lot. They nerfed the loot drop on all uh, on the zombies, so uh, if I do get anything in interesting, it's not going to be anything great. It'll be just that. Just interesting. Ooh, guess I'm getting my, I'm impaling myself on my own equipment there. Get rid of this. All right, so I need to think about this a little bit longer here I, before I start repairing stuff. Maybe go back and get my uh, my cobblestone there. All right, so anybody see any deer anywhere? I bet just lowering that won't be enough. Um, yeah, we'll see. It might take a little bit for it to start for them to start spawning in. All right, well, folks, if you enjoyed this episode, go ahead and smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode where we try to uh, dig out more of my base and uh, do some more looting and see if we can get some more supplies. Until then, Auf Wiedersehen.